I don't always drink my coffee with my hand in the air, but when I do, it tastes so much better. Good morning. We are departing Calabash Bay and we're heading to the east side of Long Island. We have about a 12 hour day as far as sunlight and we have a 45 mile sail, nautical miles. So if we hit five knots, we should be there in nine hours before the sun sets on the other side of the island. We are sailing with a nice uh, northeast wind right now, apparent wind of 10 knots, and it should accelerate through the day, uh, maybe into the upper teens. So it should be a great sail, maybe a beam reach, broad reach, or we're gonna be reaching of some sort, and it's gonna be a good one. So can't wait to share with you and I really hope we catch that mahi, the one that got loose last time. And uh, nothing dramatic, hope nothing dramatic happens. All right, we got about uh, 30 minutes of motoring straight in the wind to get around this coral on the north side of Long Island, but this is where they claim Christopher Columbus landed. Check out. And as they say, the rest is history. having a good time in the cockpit, just chillaxing, We're about to have some uh, toast. And I'm prepping the lures, about to drop them in. I figured I'd share with you what I'm fishing with. In case we catch something, you'll know what works. And when we don't catch anything, you'll know what doesn't. <laughs> so, I lost my favorite lure on that big mahi um, recently. Now I have a mahi-colored squid tail. It's got a lead weight in it. It's a double rig. On the other side of the rig is a squid tail with a spoon on the back side. You see that? And that's the longer side. It's going to go a little lower. Sun's coming up. <coughs> Fish should be biting. We are in 40 feet of water. It's about to drop off, about to hit the shelf into the thousands. And we'll be sailing at about one to 5,000 feet. Wish me luck. Hitting about five to six knots of speed. Uh, hitting about 16 knots of parent wind. So that means the wind's blowing around 13 or 14. And we're doing a close reach, about 60 degrees. Our heading is 144 and it feels real good. Um, the swell, ooh, the swell's just nice enough. Maybe about four foot swell. Um, let me get it here so you don't have that wind noise. About a four foot swell. And um, man, everything feels great. This is lovely. We have 40 nautical miles left to go and it's 8 a.m. So things are good aboard Cadence. Watching that fishing lure, making sure we catch something. But all in all, this is a good sail so far. Really good.
put a root beer in the fridge for Olivia when we get to Anchorage. She will enjoy that. So it's a uh, good sale so far. We're, it's not even noon yet. We have uh, less than 30 nautical miles to go, averaging currently about six knots. All right, let's see how Nancy's doing in this sale. Nancy, give us the old update. Well, it's quite a pleasant sale. We are just riding along. I think we're doing about six knots. We have about an hour and a half to go. The wind is kind of cool. It's not too hot unless you're sitting in the sun. And I don't know, we're all just kind of piled up in here having a great time. She made a great lunch for us. I did go downstairs and make ramen and uh, that might have been a little too much for me. After the second one, I needed to come up big too, time. Too much shaking down below? Too much, yeah. The waves aren't that big, but uh, we're healed a little more than we sometimes are. And so it was just the whole standing with yourself sideways kind of got to me with the heat on. But anyway, we're having a good time. I'm over it now, just chilling. We're getting and closer. Mocha looks like she died at sea. Always. Oh, you can see her. Silly dog. Anyway. It's been a great day. What do you think, Matt? Back yes. to you, Matt. Back to you, Matt. Hey, thank you, Nancy. Yes, we're looking good out here. Um, so, having a great time. Uh, we've learned that there's a half to one knot current fighting against us. Our little paddle wheel, which is like a speedometer that gauges the water speed below the boat, is measuring six and a half to 6.9 knots. And our boat speed is like five and a half to six. So uh, we got a current working against us and most likely it's the Gulf Stream coming from the Atlantic Ocean, uh, moving you know all the way from the Western African coast. It moves all the way across into the Caribbean. The same Gulf Stream that goes around the East Coast of the United States there's also a bit of it that comes here on the eastern side of the Bahamas. So we're experiencing that firsthand. Um, but the sea state's great. So we thought we had no idea what to expect out here with the waves reflecting off of the uh, island, which is about five miles east of us. And uh, it's not causing any issues. We have two to five foot swells and little two to three foot waves. So it's great. Winds consistently 12 to 14 knots. Pretty happy with today's sail. Um, I do see the land. You're not gonna see it. The GoPro will not pick it up. We're about 12 nautical miles away. The land is over there. That's where we're gonna anchor up. So about two more hours. Um, we took the sail. It was about a 10 hour sail. Looks like we've cut it down to about seven, seven and a half. So good speed today. Isn't that fun when the boat does that? Let's check that out.
incredible, aren't they? Well, that's another lovely passage in the books. We're thankful for you watching this video and glad you could join us here on YouTube. Now, we have plenty more stories to share, but those will have to wait till next week. If you have any questions or comments, please drop them down below. And we'll see you next week.